They saw from Scrot's Twitter. Okay, so Scrot's memeing. Okay. I need fucking players to not meme. Like, people will listen to strong players and be like, Haha, they made funny joke. I'll repeat funny joke. It's like, oh shit. I, I, need, I need players to not meme because the meme will, be, will take, take on legs of its own and then it becomes really hard to not be a clown because then being able... It's so hard to... Um, to... I had a word for it. I can't remember. To, to like... Like when people hear memes about shit and it takes on legs, it's hard to stop that. It's hard to like tell people, wait, that's not true. That's just a joke. Don't say that anymore. CR can call Hawker disliker to be on. I mean, it's okay to like those characters, dislike those characters, but you can't say stuff like, oh, if you play these characters, you're a bad person. Because you know, there are people who actually play those characters and they'll take that to heart and they'll be like, like, I'm just playing a video game, bro. Why do you think I'm a bad person? That's someone playing a strong character should not mean you think they're a bad person or you think they're less of a person because that's that's your you're personally attacking someone at that point until it is i start believing you exactly naoto's cool though naoto's fucking cool also hard to play naoto's hard to play and like when you get those combos you feel like a fucking chad i love watching naoto combos the soul bad guy <laughs> the justice player effect like, I don't have problems with people who play, like, Justice, or Testament, or Zappa, or Soul and Strive, or Ram and Strive. I don't have problems with those players. I'm just like, damn, this character's mad strong, fuck. Like, sometimes fighting them is not fun, which is fine. You just can't attack the person who picked the character. That's literally it. Arthritis jokes? Yeah, that, yeah, that's not fun. Because it's like, maybe you don't have Arthritis playing the character. Maybe playing the character for you is good. If people hear that, oh, if you want to play a Naruto, you better have, like, uh, wrist braces or whatever, because that's what he's going to do for you. And people will get scared. People will be like, oh, shit, does that really happen? I don't want to lose. I don't want to get Carpal Tunnel. I just want to play the character. And then they find out later that that was a joke, and they could have played Naruto, like, a year ago or something, right? You don't want to do that shit. Like, everyone who plays fighting games does that shit, and I'm really tired of that. Because there are so many people who have been dissuaded from playing a bunch of characters or just didn't play fighting games at all because people would just come at them and be like, oh, you play Elfelt? Uh, damn, it, what's it like not having brains? Or, damn, you play Johnny? What's it What's it like being carried? Or like, you're not a good player. What's it like play, uh, playing this? It's like, it's like, what? Bro, I'm just playing the character. The character's strong doesn't mean I'm supposed to be a beast at them. I like playing the fucking character. And even if I did want to play a strong character, that doesn't fucking give you the right to call me like an animal or anything like that. Or to say like, I have no working brain cells or some shit like that. Like, you should actually go fuck yourself. And that's what I want a lot of people to start doing. Like if you hear dumb shit like that, you just don't interact with that person anymore. Like it doesn't matter if that person's like, they taught you how to play fighting games and they're starting to make fun of you for stuff like that and they're not giving you proper context. You just stop talking to that person. They're re redirecting blame for losing to character character. Yeah, it's, it's shit. But it's not F FGC exclusive. It happens in like to FPSs. It happens in MOBAs. It happens in MMOs when people PvP. So it's just like I don't know. They have wool jacks for brain cells. The all grapplers eat paint. There are people who really dislike grapplers, which is okay. It's okay to hate. A, a, a character you don't attack the person who's playing that character that's how it works if you say like damn i don't like this character because they just do this this and that someone would be like oh maybe i like that stuff okay whatever i'll play that character but then you don't fucking say that oh if you play this character you are subhuman you deserve to die you deserve to have no you don't do that shit ah oh, i'm still still red like i want people to understand that it's very simple to to separate the two because when you attack a when you attack someone personally that doesn't go away they they will remember that shit and i've heard of a bunch of people who who straight up stop playing different fighting games because they would always hear the same thing someone who played elfelt was just like i was tired of hearing all the elfelt shit like oh damn you play elfelt you must not think or you get carried or you must hate people and it's like, what? But people still hate on you? That's crazy. Because as a beginner, you have no idea why the character is strong. You just like the character. Or maybe you like certain traits about the character and you find later on that they're S tier. 
You know, and you're like, oh, I play a strong character. That's cool. That should not stop you from playing the character. But yeah, uh, what I was saying. I bought Alpha Guns and Fruit Oki was fun. Yeah, exactly. You're just like, oh, this is this is fun. I'm just, this is, I'm gonna do this. It's cool. Which Blade Blues had the super god tier Kokonoi in it. 1.0. 1.0 Kokonoi was whew. That character, whew, that character, that character was something else. She did all the damage. She had, she had an inescapable super that did not scale the following amount of damage she had. So she was more or less broken. And people who played that character were like, I like either I like this character or I want to win. And there's nothing wrong with either of those. It's just the character herself was busted, and then they nerfed her. They nerfed her in the next version, but she was still strong. She's still a strong character, minus the fact that, like, you know, they took away the broken thing, which is fine. Okay, good, good. One point, yeah, 1.0 yeah, Coconut was a nightmare. You picked up Johnny because it's kind of more sick as fuck after fucking around with three characters before. Yeah, exactly. Like, <clears throat> you'll find a character who has cool combos and you'll be like, oh shit, I fucking like that. That's fucking cool, right? And then. Sorry, I'm, I'm unplugging my stick. And then you'll learn that, like, hey, okay, these combos are cool, I'm gonna learn this character. And then people say, like, damn, you're playing, like, the best character in the game, how does it feel to, to be a fucking cheater? And you're like, what? Like, where did that even come from? Like, th there's no, there's no semblance of that shit. Like, if you play strong characters, you will feel guilty because you're like, damn, am I really good or am I getting carried by my character? Because everyone says my character's really good and I'm, they don't praise me or they don't give me props. Like, that feels bad, you know? Cause not everyone has a mental fortitude to be like, oh, you think my character's better than the way I express myself? Cool, I'm just gonna beat everyone all the time and get first place and show you up. Not everyone has that mindset, which sucks because like, that's the best way to shut people up usually. I just wish people in it who played fighting games were fucking not stupid.